Hi, in this video I'm going to spend a little bit of time following on from the, it's still in the key of C at the 8th position, the 8th fret. Um, I'm going to look at the blue, what I call the blues pump, the bu -bu 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 -bu. and I'll also look at the shuffle pattern as well. Now we've got two, last time, we also mentioned last time the um, actual sequence and numbers, the count. So I'm not going to get into that because I broke it down in the last video. What I am going to look at is the um, yeah, what I call the blues pump. Okay, so we have the first finger on the eighth fret, the third finger on the tenth fret, on the A string. So we have these two notes. Okay, which incidentally is one, two, three, four, five. These 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 are fifths. Okay, the interval is a fifth. Now then, these lead to power chords. <laughs> So that, that's a little bit of history. These these are power chords. Now, this blues developed, and I'm sure Whiskey will put me straight, and please do Whiskey, because remember, you're the authority. I'm just uh, fried breakfast with it all. Okay, so we've got these two. And the little finger goes onto the 12th fret on the A string. So we have... could use a second finger or I've even seen this okay variations on the theme so let's do that for four one two three four two three four three two three four four two three four five two three four six two three four seven two four eight two three four nine two Okay, and then back to C. Now, just having a look at the um, right hand, very often in early blues it was downstrokes. Oh. As I as I developed my playing, I got very lazy. I did down up strokes because it was just played easier. Uh, the other thing to note is that the edge of the guitar very often cut cut the skin on my forearm. So, um, I know Joe Strummer suffered with that, but he wasn't a blues player, so anyway, for now. For now. Oh, let me just move back. Okay, so, yeah, that was an issue, because you got your, your, your forearm chopping away at the guitar. So, that's what I call the blues pump. Now, uh, added to that, there, there was um, there's another note you could have, which is this note. to the seventh turn around later so that's that that's the blues pump now the shuffle rhythm shuffle the shuffle the one and the two and the three and the four works well with that Okay, but generally speaking, that'll be played in the in the in the in the rhythm section. Okay, well, I hope that helps. Just as a reference for where this this, I remember in um, in Family Guy, they were taking the Mickey, taking the rise out of out of uh, rock early rock and roll, and now on Radio uh, KYJ or whatever. Um, it's the uh, song by Fats Domino, uh, guitar, piano riff, woo. So I'm going to play you guitar riff, woo, um, with all due respect to Family Guy. Okay. So it was. And 
so on and so on. So you, if you map through rock and roll and blues, you can hear that shuffle pattern. Sorry, the blues, what I call the blues pump, it's not called that. I don't actually know what it's called. That um, you can hear that a lot. I know we have a British, we had a British band uh, over here in the 70s and late 60s called Status Quo. If you Status Quo, exactly the spelling of the uh, Latin. If you search for Status Quo, you'll find that they based an entire career on that. And I have to say, they did that riff all the time, and they did it in different keys, and they did it beautifully. Um, it was quite a joke in the uh, in Britain in the 70s and 80s that you only needed three chords and you're a rock star because they did things like down, down, deeper and down, um, rocking all over the world and that is a corking link track. It's a, a very well known UK track over here. Um, rocking all over, I'm not sure what key it is, I'll play, I'll try it in C and uh, it, I'll sing it tremendously badly, not on purpose, it's just the way it is. <laughs> Rocking all over the world Giddy up and giddy up and get out the way We're going crazy and we're going today Here we go Rocking all over the world And I like it, I like it, I like it, I like it La 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 like it, la 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 like it Here we go Rocking all over the world and so on, and I'm playing it terribly badly, but there you go. <laughs> right. So there you go, there's a link track. That's about 1970, early 70s, mid-70s, uh, by a band called Status Quo. I suggest you listen to it because that was just shocking, what I just did. And it's a major insult to a cracking track. Okay, hope this helps. Hope this was um, give you something to think about. Please click subscribe, uh, click the down down button or the up button if you feel so inclined. Either way, do something before you leave and comment if you really if you really want to. Okay, see you later. Bye.